everyone welcome back to my channel this is Halen also known as med student planner today I will be planning out the week of April 19th through the 25th of my Erin Condren vertical planner I will be using a kit from lemon honey studio this is the garden party kit and I've already laid down the base of the spread as you can see and this is what else I have to use so the kit came with some icons that I just love and then you have your boxes sheet with half boxes quarter boxes and then some headers over here this is where the full boxes came from and then the one that's blank I kind of left out. This one has like a lot of blank space like I can work more with this one and then this is where the bottom washi and date covers came from and I have an extra quarter box to use there. And then this is just another functional sheet that it came with. So I love this size of kit so much and I have been loving this shop lately and I'm really excited to use this kit. Um, and now we can just go ahead and go through the day by day plans. Okay, so starting with Monday, I was going to find a sticker to marketing and clinic all day this day. I thought it'd be fun to kind of pull the stickers with you instead of already having them pulled. And so let me know what you think about that. It kind of makes it a little bit longer of a video, but I think I was able to kind of still speed it up in a good way to not keep you here all day. So I was initially going to pull a Scrub Winston, but couldn't find the same peach color that was in the kit. And so I just pulled a Dr. Winston from Nightingale Paper Co to mark being in clinic literally all day this day. We were there from 8 to 4.30. And this week in general was a heavy clinic day and or heavy clinic week. And so you'll see lots of clinic time. Um, then I pulled in a flag to mark placing an Amazon and Jet pins order. The pin I'm actually using in this plan with me is one of the new ones. Um, I, I have a <laughs> Energel Clina barrel, but I actually have a Sarasa dry refill in it. So I'm actually using a Sarasa dry kind of pen right now and I love it. I have the 0 0.5 and it is, it is beautiful. It just writes amazing. It's still like a good thick. It almost writes more like a 0 0.7. I just, I love it. So then I pulled a me time script from the kit because I was just kind of hanging out by myself this night. Then I have a TV icon from Nightingale Paper Co. to mark catching up on Grey's Anatomy. I ended up being two episodes behind. I thought I was only one behind, so I was going to spread that out between Monday and Tuesday. And then I was initially pulling this in bed early script from Hand Can Plants, but I, I'm going to change that. I changed that a couple times. And then I was playing Pac-Man this night. I got the new Pac-Man. It ended up being so much harder than I thought it was going to be. I kind of just wanted like some classic Pac-Man, but still wanted to try it. And it was free with the Nintendo Switch Online. And so I just went ahead and tried it. I wasn't the biggest fan of it. Um, but this is where I'm trying so hard to make it all fit. <laughs> the vertical Winston did not work out. And so I'm going back and I'm going to pull a horizontal one. I almost thought and I had an emoji from Coffee Monsters Co. with the Switch, but I could only find my Animal Crossing ones. Um, I'm not sure if I was just missing them or what was going on, uh, but it's fine. It ends up working out and it, like the horizontal Switch was going to be fine. I just don't like this one as much. I don't really know why. I, I mean, it works fine. So I'm going to pull that and then I'm just going to write playing Pac-Man. And you'll see in a bit that I still change it more. <laughs> So then moving on to Tuesday, I'm going to pull in a third box and then mark that we had so many lectures this day. I think we had four hours of lecture and that is not normal for us anymore. And so that was very draining and just kind of ridiculous. Um, I pulled in this side-eyed coffee cup girl from Fox and Cactus to mark just how silly it was <laughs> and how I felt about it. Most of them weren't even that helpful either. And so that's why it just felt like a waste of time. Um, but I wanted to mark that we just had so many lectures this day. And then I pulled in a less adulting, more coffee script and coffee cup deco piece from the kit. And then I have a half box and I'm going to pull a scrub emoji to mark that I was in clinic until 4.30 for the rest of the day. I thought this blue scrubs emoji matched perfectly. And so I was excited to be able to pull that. And I'm almost out of those. I'm going to have to order some more in my next Coffee Monsters Co. order. So then I went and pulled an eating Winston to mark what I had for dinner. My mom had packed me with some taco salad stuff to make my first couple of nights so that I was out of town. Um, I was in Monroe this week 
I don't think I've mentioned that, but I was in Monroe this week for um, my OB rotation. We have to go to this other location um, a couple times throughout the our third year of medical school, and this was my last time to have to go, so I was very excited about that. Um, then after I finished eating dinner, I pulled um, a TV icon to mark watching Grey's Anatomy. I was all caught up at this point, and so that was nice to be ready for the next one that was coming out. And this is where I decided to change some things up from Monday. I had actually finished a book on Monday that I decided I really wanted to mark that more than the other things. And so I pulled an emoji that's reading in bed from Copy Monsters Code to mark that I finished A Court of Silver Flames. Um, I got that book as soon as it was released and I've just been taking my sweet time reading it. It's one of my all-time favorite series and so I really just wanted to enjoy it and take my time because... If I let myself, I'd probably read it in like a couple of days and I just couldn't do that. <laughs> and so it was nice to be able to spread it out and actually get some like good time with the book. I'm not sure if we will have any more books from that series or like that storyline. So it was also good to be able to take my time with it for that reason too. Um, and then I pulled that same um, Switch Winston to Mark Plain Pac-Man on Tuesday because I... I still need to get some good use out of that sticker, and I'm still playing Pac-Man, so it ended up working out better this way, and I like how the spread turned out more this way. So then I'm pulling a same half box situation to Mark being in clinic this day, and I found a coffee cup from the Crafty Banana that's literally the perfect color green for this like shade of green. Almost like too perfect because it like blends in with the half box, but I had to pull it, and I love that. It's it's one of my custom ones from their shop, and I I love that I found one that matched. Um, then I also pulled a flag to mark our weird day in the hospital. The lights were out for some unknown reason, and so we were going off of the natural lighting from windows and some like extra floodlights from like the generators and whatnot. And it was just such a weird day. The lights eventually came back on in the afternoon, but we went out for lunch this day since the cafeteria wasn't open, so I had that marked with a quarter box, and then I had pulled another Me Time script from the kit, and I've been current, there's the Me Time script, but I've been trying to figure out what I wanted to do at the bottom. There was lots of changing going on <laughs> you were seeing, um, so this is what I settled on. I have a candle that also matched perfectly from the Crafty Banana to Margaret Studying. Then I have a TV icon to mark Minging Riverdale, and then another uh, half box at the bottom there. So moving on to Thursday, I started the day with this little three box checklist to mark a few things I needed to get done. I had a presentation to give on Friday, and so I needed to work on that and get everything finished for the presentation. And then I had some videos to watch before we had another lecture, and so needed to finish up that. And then um, we have a checklist of things that we have to get done during this rotation of different things we need to see, and so I just needed to update my checklist. So I once again tried to pull a scrub Winston, but this yellow just was too, it was too different. It wasn't really going, and so... I'm going to pull that back up and then I will change that out for another Dr. Winston since it's more of a neutral option. Um, I also wanted to pull in this quarter box here and I'm going to pull in a heart Winston um, to mark that I saw two deliveries this day. Um, we had not seen any babies all week and so it was nice to be able to get a good dose of the, we had one this morning and then one like at the end of the day. So it was like a nice start and end to my day. Then I pulled in that Dr. Winston to mark that we were just in the clinic still this day until 4.30. So this night I went out for dinner and I grabbed some pizza and I was going to pull a pizza icon and then I also grabbed some ice cream this night. So I, I ended up pulling my ice cream at Winston because I hardly go out and like get ice cream like that. And so it was nice to be able to get some good use out of that one. So I finally got to use this in bed early script. I've been trying to use it all week because I was really trying to make um, my sleeping schedule a little bit more regular with going to bed early since we were waking up a little bit earlier in Monroe. And so I finally got that together. And then I pulled this TV icon to mark watching more Riverdale. So for Friday, I have the TGIF sticker from the kit 
that was just so perfect. I was very happy for it to be Friday, and it was one step closer to me being able to go back home. Um, then I had a half box to pull because I ended up being in surgery all day or all morning, and that was exhausting. But I was initially going to pull in clinic stuff, and then I realized that I actually ended up not having to go to clinic. So I am instead going to pull this surgeon emoji and mark that with being in clinic. I put the sticker on the wrong side of where I put the other one, and so it was going to be sticky where I was writing. So then I came and did some undo on it, but you'll see that I will be back in a second. So I'm going to let that dry and just move on. Um, I, I wanted to pull a Yay Winston, and then I'm also going to pull another sticker from the Coffee Monsters Co. For my presentation, I had these stickers where you're like on a present or you're on like the computer. It's like a Zoom emoji pretty much. And so that was perfect because our presentations were over Zoom. So I just marked that in. And then I'm using the Yay Winston because I was initially supposed to stay until Saturday, but they ended up letting me go home early on Friday. And so of course I had to mark that. I was very excited to be able to go home and I pretty much looked like this Yay Winston. So this is where I realized that I didn't take out all of the stickiness and so I'm going back to just completely make this half box new again and I will be back in another second once it dries again to finish that one up. So I just pulled in this quarter box label thing. I'm not really sure what to call it since it has a little flag on it. But anyways, I just used that to mark going to dinner with some friends and then we came home and watched some morning show. Um, we have been loving the morning show. I don't, well, I say I, I have been loving the morning show. I'm not sure if my husband does or not, but that's fine. So I finally get to finish up the half box with the little surgeon emoji to mark being in surgery this morning. And then moving on to Saturday, I hadn't really used any of the headers that came with the kit. And so I decided to go ahead and pull one for Saturday. And then I was going to head and pulling a couple scripts that I know I wanted to use. And I finished the sleep in script from Virgo on Paper. And so I always love finishing a sheet of stickers. So I get to pull that out. And then I'm going to pull in this little computer icon to mark studying this day. I got lots of good studying in. And then I was going to pull the planner time script that you saw earlier but I saw this one with the kit and so I thought that was perfect to be able to use that and so I have the planner time script with the planner that came with the kit and I like how that turned out together. Then I just pulled in this little bow on a clip to mark filming a part two of my haul video that was showing you the new pins and everything that I'm really excited to show you um, so you'll have a little bit more than just stickers to see in my haul. Then I pulled a quarter box and a, or that may be a third box actually, but I pulled a binge watch script from Kinsey's Creations to mark that I started watching Shadow and Bone this night and ended up watching the first half of the se the season and it was, it was so good. I was so impressed with what they did with that show. I loved those books and I was just so excited to start that show. Um, and then we also had a date night this night and so I got to use my new little couple emojis to mark that. Then on Sunday, I started the day by studying again. So I had a half box and a cute little emoji that has a little backpack and like books on to mark studying. And then I am going to pull a film script because I was filming my plan with me this day. And so I have that with another planner that came with a kit. This kit just has such good deco and scripts and everything. And so I love that pairing. And then I had a little bit of extra space there. So I'm just going to pull in another one of the headers. We had my dad's sobriety dinner this night, and so I pulled that in with a quarter box. Um, I don't know if you saw earlier in the week, but he was celebrating four years sober, and so that was such an awesome thing to be able to celebrate with him, especially since we didn't get to celebrate last year. And so after we finished up dinner and everything, I had a little bit of laundry that I needed to get done, and so I'm going to pull a laundry day script from Piper Paper Company and... I'm actually going to be on the night shift next week, and so I needed to stay up this night, and so I was trying to like adjust my sleep schedule, and so I'm pulling in this movie marquee, 
and I'm going to pull in my one of my new munchkins from Once More With Love that's wrapped up in a blanket um, that has a cozy written behind it to mark that I finished Shadow and Bone. I cannot believe I watched that, that show so fast, but I have no regrets. It was such a good show. Would highly recommend that show and those books. Okay, so here is the finished spread. I love how this spread turned out so much. I love the rainbows. I love this blue. I love the green. Like this blue and green are my all-time favorite colors. And so I was so excited to be able to use this kit. And I really love how this week turned out. So thank you so much for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe down below. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, everyone.